Well, he's got a way with the saxophone. The saxophones and keyboards, Mr. Richie Kanata. We always say something before the show, and we always invite right. someone to say something yeah. before mm -hmm. the show. Kevin Hupster, okay. we haven't seen you in a while. Give, us, give us something to say, and we're going to repeat it. God bless all of you. Thank you for having me here, and it is just amazing to be back. We can't repeat all of that. <laughs> <laughs> it's amazing to be back. It's amazing to be back. again for coming to my show on Thursday night at the Bitter End. It was a huge success. We had an oversold out night and I had friends from my college days there to my brother of course, some family members and uh, a lot of fans that came out to see us play and uh, perform the music on my CD that's doing very very well on the internet charts and also on the billboard charts. Um, one of the greatest songs that night was uh, Keep It In The Pocket, which is our single that we've been doing, and, and uh, we had such great energy from the band. My band played really, really good. Julio Fernandez just was over the top on that one, and of course, New York State of Mind was a great one uh, that we did, that we just we recorded that, and I'm really happy about that. And uh, all in all, I can't thank you guys enough. It meant so much to me and to the band that I uh, had so much support, and again, uh, we'll be doing it again soon. Couple of gigs coming up this uh, summer, so look for us and uh, and uh, again thanks. See you. this great showcase, this CD breakout showcase in Manhattan. Uh, and uh, if you really want to go see good music and you want to hear good music and be able to get a good seat on a, on a, a great venue, The Bitter End was the place for me to do this. And I really again thank uh, Kenny and Paul and all the people at The Bitter End for letting us have this great night and also letting us have our Monday nights that we do. Every Monday night we do the open mic jam there. It's been years and years that I've been playing there. Uh, but this last Thursday night was an absolutely fantastic show uh, because of the turnout, because of the music, and because of all the shaking of hands of the people at the Bitter End and my band. You may say I'm a dreamer, but I'm not the only one.
guys, uh, again, just to recap some of the great moments from my show at the Bitter End the other night on Thursday night, uh, we had uh, did an encore that we weren't expected to do, which was a song called Anna C, which is the last song on my CD, of which was dedicated and written for my mom, and uh, the last time I actually did play it was the first time that I played it when we, when we recorded it, and that night was uh, unexpected, but we did it, and Julio Fernandez and I... Uh, really dug in and it was a great performance and a great tribute to my mom and I'm glad that she was there and her spirit was there and it was a great night. Oh,